Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing well. What about you? Can you hear me? Yeah, okay. How was the weekend, Gustavo? I can't hear you Hi. anymore. Hi. How was okay. your weekend? Uh, was a good weekend. I visited my parents and I don't know. I went to the Boquerón. Mm -hmm. Say, so I visited. I visited I have, my parents. I visited my parents. Yes. And I went to, I went to, I don't know. El Boquerón. Uh, I went right. to the Boquerón, yes. <laughs> awesome. That sounds like fun. And let me see who else. Hi, David. I can't see you guys. Rodrigo. Did you finish the platform? Gustavo, you finished? Yes, I finished. And you, David, you finished everything? Hi, teacher. Hi. You finished everything on the platform? Yeah. Yeah. I finished awesome. my perfect. All right. And let's continue then. We're going to pick up where we left off, which was right after the, uh, the midterm. So we're starting lesson four tonight. Can you read the objective, please, David? Well, I don't. I can see, all right, maybe I hear your microphone. Well, now this, uh -huh. go ahead, go ahead. In this lesson. All right. Mauricio, can you read it? Okay, hello. Hi. Uh, in this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation expressing likes and dislikes. Yes, all right, awesome. Let's listen. <clears throat> In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation expressing likes and dislikes. To begin our class, I want you to pay close attention to the... We haven't watched this video, have we? No, right? No? Okay. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation expressing likes and dislikes. Welcome to our section 4. Do you like rap? To begin our class, I want you to pay close attention to the following conversation. Notice how they ask questions using do and how they answer. Again, this conversation introduces us to simple present. I really like pop music. Do you like rap, Liz? No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I do. I'm a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? The piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about rap. So? What kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Who's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. On the discussion box, I want you to share with us what kind of music do you listen to or like? All right. Very good. We're going to practice this dialogue. You know how it goes introduces us to simple do you like rap liz okay where do you see the simple present here it can be questions negative affirmative where do you see simple present for example here guys do you like rap is present Okay, what else? I don't like. I don't like it is another one, very good. Even this one, do you? Simple, simple present, what else? I do. This one too, it is simple present, but it's the verb be, yes. What else? I do know. Yes, that's a short answer. Mm -hmm. 
What else? Anything in the present, guys? I Even think. This, uh huh. I think, and I know our present. What else? Does he play the piano? Perfect. So a lot of examples, guys. No, he doesn't. He's a singer. I guess. I don't know. What kind of music do you like? Basically, everything is present simple. I really like. This is present simple too. This one too. This one too. Here and here. All the conversation has present simple. All right. And we're going to practice it together with the microphones on mute. Repeat after me. Ready? <clears throat> Okay, no, after the audio, sorry. To begin our class, notice how they ask questions using do and how they answer. Notice how they ask questions using do and how they answer. Again, this conversation introduces us to simple present. Here we go. I really like pop music. Do you like rap, Liz? Do you like rap, Liz? Everybody repeat. <clears throat> No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Do you? And imitate the intonation too. Yeah, I do. I'm a, I'm a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? Piano? No, he doesn't. He's a singer. <clears throat> He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about rap. So, what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Who's your favorite singer? Celine Dion. I love her voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. On a discussion box. Okay. Now what we're going to do in pairs is we're going to modify this dialogue. Okay. So instead of saying, do you like rap music? We're going to talk about another singer that you like. For example, do you like pop? Uh, Biden? And you say, no, I, or yes, I like it very much. Okay. I'm a big fan of Dua Lipa, for example. And you say, oh, I think I know her. Does she play the piano? And you say, no, right? I think Dua Lipa doesn't play the piano, right? I don't think so. Okay. Is that clear? We're going to try to use the modal, but change the artist. So modify the conversation. Ready? Yes? No questions? All right. And let's try it. Here we go. Accept the invitation, please. Hello, hello, Rodrigo. Hello. Aquí está. Bueno, la comparto si les parece. Do you have questions, guys? No? No. 
Okay. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know much about rap. So, what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. No. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, why? I'm, I'm a big fan for for rock music. <laughs> okay. I think I know him. I think I know him. I, I think I know it. Okay. Uh, that... uh, no, I don't. Uh, no, I don't like uh, like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I do. I am fan. I am a big fan. The cancer bear. Cancer bear. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think. Uh, uh, I know him. I know him. Does he play the piano? Him. Uh, he play he play the piano the piano no he doesn't he's a singer oh i guess i don't know i don't know much about rap so what kind of music do you like i really like pop music who's your favorite singer celine dion i love her voice do you like her no i don't I don't like pop music very much. Ahora lo sustituimos, creo. Yeah. Tú inicias el ciclo. Con Oscar. ¿Tú like rap? Uh, Oscar. No, I don't like it very <laughs> much. Do you? Yeah, I do. I, I'm a big fan of Eminem. You can modify it with real information. Who are you a big fan of, Luis? Um, I'm a big fan of, um, I like Eminem. <laughs> Eminem too. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I like it, la music um, of 70s, 80s. Oh, that, that is a, a good music. <laughs> I love, I love them too. <laughs> yes. Um, uh, who's your favorite singer of music? Uh, oh, Chantes music? Oh, uh, I, I like uh, Phil Collins is the, the music yeah. of him uh -huh. is, is good. Uh, really, really, I uh, agree. It's the yeah. it's in in uh, I I I like I like it. Uh, I like uh, Phil Collins and yes um the Banglets Banglets. Ah uh, oh, yes, that is that is a good music. <laughs> Banglets because uh, uh, well, like an, an addiction is a. a a good song. I love. I love this song. <laughs> yes. Yes. Um. But um. Um. ¿Cómo se dice también me también? Um. I don't remember. <laughs> uh, yes. Yes. Um. But, um. I like. I like music. Um. And pop, rock, a eh, more or less classical. Um, instrumental, um, yeah. the the band, the band, um, I like um, rock music, um, more or less, um, uh, rock, rock soft, <laughs> rock soft, uh, <laughs> yes, <laughs> rock, uh, um, and um, el, el mago de Oz, because. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, Mago de Oz, uh, or um,
All right. Very good. Good practice. Now uh, we're going to study questions. I think, let me ask you something honestly, guys, because we have to watch that video, but we're going to practice too, okay? But be honest, all right? Uh, do you want to review the structure of the questions or can you practice now? Questions, meaning WH and the verb B with do and does. Do you want to review it? And then practice or you just want to practice? Because I think we have been seeing that topic a lot and it is part of um, lesson four. So what do you want? Okay, let me ask everyone. Hold on, I don't see anyone. View, gallery. All right, now I see everybody. So raise your hand. Marisol, I don't see you, Byron, David. So I don't know, guys, tell me. Raise your hand if you wanna review questions with WH in the present simple. No? <laughs> Mauricio. <laughs> Mauricio. <laughs> He wants to review the structure. Okay, very good. All right, we, yeah, that's okay. We can, I mean, it's part of it. It's in lesson four. Okay, we're gonna watch this. After the video, I want you to write the structure because there's no way you're gonna make mistakes if you follow the structure all the time, okay? So let's watch and write the structure. Then we're gonna practice together. At the end of this lesson, it's only two minutes, guys. will be able to ask questions in simple present using do and does along with WH question words. We will get ready to ask two types of questions, yes, no questions and WH questions. On your notes, please jot down both auxiliaries as we go over them. Remember, we use these auxiliaries for simple present tense in questions and negative answers. Yes, no and WH questions with do. Do you like rap? Yes, I do. I like it a lot. No, I don't like it very much. What kind of music do you like? I like rock a lot. Does he play the piano? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. What does he play? He plays the guitar. Do they like the Beatles? Yes, they do. They love them. No, they don't like them very much. Who do they like? They like you too. Object pronouns. Me. You. Him. Her. It. Us. Them. Did you notice both auxiliaries? Do and does. Do. Does. Did you notice the changes that occurred when we used the auxiliary in a question for third person singular? Does he play the piano? If not, play the video again until you understand it. Keep in mind that whenever we use does, the verb goes back to its base form. Something I want you to understand is when the question being asked uses a WH question word, it means we need more information when answering. In this class, as already mentioned, we're talking about two kinds of questions. Check it out. Do you like Madonna? Yes, I do. No, I don't. What does she sing? If not, I think I told you guys that the structure of yes, no questions and WH questions are the same, right? If you notice, you have do, uh, the subject and the verb, and here you have um, here, do, subject and the verb. So the only thing that is different is that you have a WH question in front of it, like this one. This is the only difference. So the structure of a yes, no question and a WH question are the same, right? I'm gonna write it. I would like you to write it because we're gonna practice uh, questions right now. And if you have doubts, you're not sure, follow the structure, okay? So for a yes, no question, it's gonna be like this. But please write it, guys. I know you probably already know it, but sometimes we make mistakes. So it's okay, we can use, uh, what is the structure of a question, guys? Do or? Yes. Or that plus. Yes. Yes. Plus what else? I'm going to give you an example. Subject. Do you like right. now? soda? All right. Subject. Subject, yes. What else? Verb. 
Ver. 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 Compliment. Compliment. Very good. This is a yes, no question. And I told you, a, a WH question is exactly the same. WH, so I'm going to copy paste it. Look. And the only thing that changes is I have a WH word here. Okay. That's it. Everything else is the same. And an example is where do you work? All right. This is the structure. Follow it the entire time. Because sometimes, sometimes we don't realize it, but some people say, for example, um, where you study. This is Spanish, right? When you say, donde tu estudias, donde estudias. It's not okay in English. You need the auxiliary the entire time. So that is the most frequent mistake, not using the auxiliary. This is absolutely incorrect, okay? This is not a question. So where do you study? Don't forget the auxiliary, all right? We're gonna practice just to make sure the structure is clear. We're gonna do this exercise. I will send you the link, but we can do number one and two together. What is number one, guys? Where do you go Where to school? Where do you go to school? Mm -hmm. Okay, awesome. And two? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Awesome. And the third one? Where does where does young come from? Come from. Come from. All right. <clears throat> Perfect. I think they're 20. Yes. <clears throat> We're gonna do them quickly, I think. So I will give you like five minute stops to do this exercise in a small group of three. Ready? I will send you the link to WhatsApp and also here. Here we go. There. Accept the invitation, please. Oh. Where are you guys? I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah. Entonces creo que hay que empezar a llenar estas preguntas. Sí. In English, sí. guys, <laughs> let's start with the questions. Okay. Part. Did you open the link? Yes. Yay. Yes. 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 Um... <coughs> oh, Hoy sí. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bueno, si quieren vamos haciendo una cada una. Uh, where number do you? Ajá. Uh -huh, number one. Where do you go to school? Where do you go? To the school. <clears throat> okay. The second. What do you? What do you do? Okay. Where does John come from? Yeah, for <clears throat> Biden Hi. or Rodrigo. <clears throat> Let's take turns. Um, how long does it 
stay from London to Paris. Yes, very good. Now, Rodrigo. Go to cinema. The cinema. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, where do you where play? Do you? Oh. What does the sport for does like? like. Uh -huh. oh. What sport? Does... Sport, sport. Es que tengo malo yo. Oh. Uh. <laughs> how do you, how uh, do they? Uh -huh. How do they yeah. get to work? work? How often do do I come? Aquí, uh -huh. perdón, aquí en la dosa sería como ellos van a su trabajo. ¿A qué horas ellos llegan a su trabajo? No, how is Como, ¿Cómo? Meaning, ¿Cómo? Uh -huh. By car, by okay. train. Ok. Ah, ¿cómo llegan a su trabajo? Ah, ¿Cómo llegan? How do, how do they? How often, often do... do I? Yes. Does. 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 Does the field start? <clears throat> ok. The last one. No, sorry. Right then. Pensé que era la última. <laughs> Where do you play tennis? Where do you play tennis? Okay. What Eleven. For, what sport does Lucy like? Sport does Lucy like? Oh. Say, get to work. Thirteen. How often do I come here? I come here. Okay. Where does she live? Where, what sport do, do, what sport does, does Lucy like? Lucy like. Right, see? Sport. Nice, sport. Nice. Oh. 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 How, how, how to, mm. I, I tenía que ser tú, porque es ellos. Puedo decir como que grab, como de la, levanta la silla, grab, así como que levant, levántate, y date como despiértate. Y el wake up es como me, me, me levanto, no, sería como, ajá, me despierto y el grab es como me levanto. Mm. Yeah, that is true. Mm -hmm. But why are you asking about get up? <clears throat> Es que estamos diciendo que, 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 que no, o sea, teníamos algunos problemas de, para entender, digamos, cuando a veces se usa el get up, porque a veces dicen get up, wake up, entonces eso es como que... Mm, ya, yeah. yeah, get up y eh, levantas, en wake up, okay. you finished, right? Yeah. Yes. 
Okay, awesome. Let's go back. All right, let me see. Yeah, it's only the three of you, I know it. <laughs> I think the majority hasn't finished, but they have to come back in one minute. So we're gonna wait. <clears throat> Look, guys, <clears throat> I sent you this image through WhatsApp, right? <clears throat> We're going to have a speaking practice right now and use the simple present and speak as much as you can. So don't give short answers, all right? So if I say, hey, what are some activities you like to do? You say, oh, I like to dance. I like to play in the afternoon and give more examples. Try to speak a lot, all right? Did you get the image? Yes. All right, we're gonna practice speaking. Later, if we have time or tomorrow, what I want you to do is I will give you the answers and I want you to make the questions because that's a difficult activity, all right? But after we practice, we can think about that. Ready? <laughs> Let's practice. We're gonna work in small groups of three. Here we go. Three, four, there, okay. Active invitation, please. Open the image. Let's speak. Let's practice. Practice the pronunciation. Okay. So simple question. What are some activities you like to do? Hmm. What are some activities you like to do? Hmm. Some activities, or oh, I like. Contestar, okay. Yes, sí, answer sería... the question. Listo. Discuss the questions. Yeah. I like, I like play football and I listen to music. I like uh, I like uh, back, uh, play play basketball and I like watch video in YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like to go to work to the park and listen to music um, in the night play video games. Okay. Okay. Other questions? Do you have any bad habits? Uh, in my case, uh, one bad habit is uh, I drink Coca-Cola. <laughs> I like how my often case, I like, how often do you drink uh, coke uh, in my case uh, I think is uh, drink a coffee no the coffee is, is very good <laughs> it's a good thing <laughs> it's not a bad habit <laughs> it's, a <laughs> it's a good habit <laughs> <laughs> uh, Byron, coffee how often with, do you drink with uh, sorry teacher with with semita so. <laughs> <laughs> with semita <laughs> how often semita do you drink is 
Mm. Ah, yeah, right. There's the same that says, es más fácil salir del mundo de la droga que del pan con café. Con café. <laughs> It's true. <laughs> It is It's difficult. True. All right. Byron, how often do you drink Coke? Every uh, day, three times a day. Uh, I how drink often? every, every, every night. Ah, okay. Every, every day night. at lunch time. Every day. Uh -huh. I okay. love that. All right, all right. In, in less time, yeah, I think it's a good habit. <clears throat> Say a good habit. Habit, ah, yeah. Yes, habit. habit. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank, thank you very much. <laughs> well. All right. What about an you? Now. Mm -hmm. At the uh, 12 p.m. or 1 a.m. <laughs> oh, it's very late. <laughs> yeah, very, very late. Um, Grenets. What is something you eat almost every day? Um, I eat almost um, the the rice. <clears throat> uh, maybe, <laughs> and you? In the mornings, I I eat in uh, almost eggs and beans with the bread. Bread? Uh, how do you say? Bread? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. That. That's it. Say the answer again, Oscar. In the morning. In the morning, I I eat. It, mm -hmm. and eggs, beans, and bread. Yes, okay, awesome. Good, good, good. What are some good habits that you have? Um, um, I have, I like hobbies. Habits, you, habits. Um, yes, you, you mentioned eat a uh, salad, uh, vegetables, Yes. You mentioned. Yeah. Mm. Yes, I like to eat vegetables and salad. Um, I like uh, I like uh, care Do my my garden. Oh, okay. Yeah, yes, I like my garden. And did you uh, do exercise? I more or less oh, okay because I don't don't like exercise. Oh okay. <laughs> Como you... diría, soy perezosa. Ay, <laughs> ay, ay. Sí, soy perezosa, pero no me recuerdo cómo se dice. I am lazy. I am lazy. <laughs> <laughs> And you? Toca tu coluca. Caja de crédito, saca tu coluca. Ustedes trabajan con I'm Are you working lab? with Fede Credito? Okay. Yeah. Yes. In I'm, your case? Uh, Are you it, work with, with Fede Credito or no? Sí. Okay. It's, it's our supervision. Mm, okay. It's our supervision. Uh, and I have the internal audit in his case, in this case, in this car, the Credito. Uh, my labor, labor is supervision. Carmel. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me see other question. The last one, what do you do in your free time? Okay. Uh, uh, I do <clears throat> drive my car. Oh, okay, nice. Yes. Um, and you? Uh, well, I got to my work. Yes. Um, I, I don't know. I, I have meetings, a lot of meetings. Oh, okay. Um, 
uh, I do the dinner. Yes. I I do exercise at night. <laughs> yes, it's very good. It's very yes, good. Yes, I like I like do exercise. In yes. uh I don't know to say elliptica. I don't elliptica. No? <laughs> no sé cómo se dice elliptica. <laughs> Yes, you know, I don't know. Ah, yeah. right. Oh, bike. yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. Like, and do you have any bad habits? Habits? Oh, habits. about habits. Okay, I think everyone's back. Here's the exercise, guys. I'm going to help you with the first two. It is difficult, but we can do it together. Okay, this is the answer. What do you think the WH question to the answer is? It says, I go to the hairdressers about once a week. What's my WH question, guys? Once a week is the answer. So what is the question? Mm -hmm. How often? Yes. Okay. Everything. How, how, often? Pardon, how often do you go to the hair hairdresser? <coughs> how often do you go to the hair dresser? Dresser. And the answer is once a week. Is that clear? All right. This is a little bit more difficult because sometimes people don't take into account the fact that last is a verb and it means durar, okay? So you can say my phone battery lasts, because it is third person, right? Lasts 18, mine is like 24 hours, I think, 28 hours, okay? Or you can say, for example, Titanic guys, Titica, no Titanic. Titanic, all right. Titica. Titanic lasts an eternity. No, like three hours, right? <laughs> three hours, I think, right? Yes. Very long. Okay. So the verb last means durar. Okay. It's a verb also. It doesn't only mean el último, all right? So what is the question, guys? Think. Mm -hmm. And remember that when you ask for the duration of something, what? how do we ask? What's the WH question? To ask cuánto, but time. I think I told you that. How long when you want to ask for the duration, OK? Or time. Not how much time, guys. How long, OK? So what is the question? Hello. Yes, follow the structure and it is okay. Look. WH, auxiliary, subject, verb, right? But the problem is when we translate, we would say, for example, something like a how much time the lesson 
last. That is Spanish. It's not English, all right? We have to follow the structure. Very good. Good job. And number three, let's do it together. This is time. So you can say how long again. How long? How long do, uh, do, do we have the steam? Mm -hmm. How long do we have before uh, yeah. we have to go out? And the answer is one hour. And if you want to add still, how long do we still have before we have to go out? Question mark. One more. I don't know exactly. I think I have more or less 2,000 comics. What's the question? Mm -hmm. How many? How many? Yes. How many? How many do you? How many? How what? many? How many co comics? Comics. Do you, do you have? Do you, do you have? have? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. So you're gonna tell me, hey, but if we have wh, why is it that we have comics here? The subject is you. It's not comics. All right. And I want you to modify something in the structure, which is here. Look. Right here, here, okay, let me modify it too. If you wrote this on the notebook, please modify it. And here we're gonna put this, okay? Because many questions are gonna start like, how many brothers and sisters, right? Do you have, yes or no? Brothers and sisters, do you have? Okay, so we can say, I am following the structure, but I'm adding details to my question, to my WH question. How many brothers and sisters do you have? And I still have the, uh, the structure, okay? I can also say how long, not only how, all right? So that's another detail. I can say, for example, how, um, how much sugar do you want, all right? So we can add details to the WH question. Is that clear? So, so, right. Let me see. Do you wanna do one more example or are you ready? Ready to work in pairs or in groups? More examples. I don't know. You don't yeah. know guys, so. Yes, more example. All right, let's continue. Tomorrow, I'm going to have you work in groups. Tonight, we can finish as a group here. Okay, number five, what do you think the question is? We're talking about price. How do we ask for the price of something? How much? How much? How much? Very good. How much? That's the, the, red, the red shirt. shirt. And what is the verb? The verb is not here with the, because the, it's the verb B, so it's a different question. But anyway, we're almost finished. How much does the red shirt cost? Okay, or with the verb B, you have two options with the verb B or with the verb cost. Number six, um, nope, nope, we're gonna do eight. Number eight, I come from a little town of Sweden. What is the question? Where? Yes, where, where do you live? Do you? Do you, what is the verb in the sentence? Come. Come. Where do you come? From. From. Um. Perfect. So notice, uh, also this is important for you because you're going to see this in the past, present, future, and at all times. You're going to see that. And I think I told you, I don't know. I'm not sure, guys. But I think I told you that in Spanish we say de donde, right? 
we say con quién, we say para qué. So all of that, for example, de dónde or con quién, we're going to send that, that extra part to the end of the sentence, okay? That is the reason why we have from at the end because we don't modify the structure here. We have to start with WH, okay? All right, one more and we finish. Um, let me see, 13. What is it? When? I think is that the answer is novels. What kind? What kind? Mm -hmm. What kind of novels kind. do you like? What kind of novels do you read? Do you read? Yeah. Perfect. Okay, this is what we're going to practice tomorrow because I know it was complicated, but I want you to be ready with WH questions in the present simple in a complex form too. All right, because this is not advanced, guys. This is still basic. So we have to be able to do this. You can do it. Any questions? No, teacher. No. no. All good? All right. No. Thank you guys for joining me, and I hope to see you all tomorrow. Have a beautiful Good night. 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 Good night.